going here. Uh, first off, I just want to say I hope everybody had a good and fun, safe 4th of July. Hope there were no injuries. Hope everybody ate some good food. Um, you know, celebrating our independence. I, I love America, and I know we all did. Uh, for those of you who are not American watching this, um, I hope you're just as patriotic about your country as we are about ours. And uh, I, I hope your July 4th was just as safe and just as fun as everyone's in America. Uh, on to other things. <clears throat> Figure I'd go ahead and let some folks know. Uh, despite the apparent failure of the Kickstarter project, which is imminent in any day now, I think it's got like nine or eight or nine days left on it, uh, it's pretty much going to fail. But that's okay. Uh, despite what I said in the video for the Kickstarter project, I still am going to go do On the Hunt for Season 2. I'm going to at least try to do Season 2. Um, and it's, it's going to be pretty good. i got a lot of plot ideas in mind. I've already started drafting the first episode. I've started talking to all my old actors. We're going to have a lot of people hopefully coming back. Um, even some new characters, of course, some more recognizable monsters, vampires, aliens, things like that. Um, other than that, i got a couple other things coming up. There is going to be a project I'll be doing called Jacked Up Storytime. And the essential format is it's going to be... It's going to be like you're hearing children's stories, but they're clearly not children's stories at all. Um, and it's going to be various writers on that project. I'm pulling in um, five writers plus myself, so it's going to be six different writers. We're all going to do two stories a piece, and um, that's going to give us a good 12 episodes. They're going to be slightly animated. It's mostly just going to be pan and scanning on static images. So, uh, you know, like I said, like it's a children's story. You guys remember the old uh, PBS children's story anim half-ass animated shows. That's that's pretty much the effect I'm going to be going for. Uh, I also would love to do something with Turpentine Valley, my comic. I don't know if I want to relaunch the comic. I've been trying to do that a million times and it just never works out. Uh, I've also entertained the idea of a 2D animated show. I've entertained the idea of a 3D animated show. Neither of which I really had the skill to complete myself and finding people to help me with this project isn't exactly easy because, you know, let's face it, without the money, they really don't share any kind of the passion for the project. Um, so that's going to be a challenge. I'm just going to have to find a way to overcome. Uh, I've also, of course, considered a live action Turpentine Valley, which presents its own set of challenges, but I think in the end it would probably be easier to do. I don't think it would do Turpentine Valley justice to do it in real life, however. Although I could be wrong. I, I couldn't find a way to make it work. I got a couple other projects uh, that you know, may or may not see their way on and off the back burner. I'll uh, get more into those uh, as I know more about them. So, uh, once again, just hope everybody had a good 4th of July, and, um, till next time, Sladio1, out.